I can't believe it's really you, Asya. We don't have much time, Scarrett. I know this, but I choose a single moment with you over an eternity with anyone else. Cut. That was great, guys. That was perfect. Oh, Tommy, you're so talented. Does she have to do that every time? Thanks for coming. I know this isn't your favorite. Yeah, I mean, as long as I don't actually have to participate, I'm good. <laughs> Quinn. You good, Quinn? Hey, okay. Yeah, you hardly ate breakfast. I had a stomach ache. Oh, um, you want a protein bar? I'm good. Wow, you came. Why wouldn't I? Plus, I even brought a feast offering for TK. I mean, he is working with Wes, so might as well make the best out of it. Plus, we had a good conversation the other day. You guys are talking. I'll give you the details later, if you and I are talking. Well, for good gossip, I might be amenable. Enjoy. And one for you. Thanks. Yeah, of course. Wow, berry smoothies, my <laughs> favorite. Um, aren't you allergic to strawberries? Yeah. Are you the assistant? I love a smoothie. I'm not an assistant. Rhyme. Rhyme, I've heard so much about you. I'm Sadie, Tommy's girlfriend. Tommy? Girlfriend. Slow down, we're not even halfway done. Our civilization will never recover. We'll flow like dust among the stars, but at least we'll be together. Guys, I'm picking up a phone ring. Cut. I'm sorry, guys, it's long distance. Let's take time. Ro Robbie, I, ugh, I can't. Oh my. <laughs> Can I sit? <laughs> Can you believe that girl just shows up like she owns the place? Is this your idea of an apology? You're still mad, huh? Yeah. I mean, you threw a makeup sleepover, but then you lit it on fire. Okay, yeah, technically, that was the cookies, but... Okay, fair point. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I'm having an identity crisis right now. We just want to be here for you. No, you are. You always are. Even when you're dressed like an alien. Yeah, well, look who's having an identity crisis now. <laughs> and, I mean, not that you asked my opinion, but I think Wes is feeling a little underappreciated. I know. Um, we burst a bulb. I know you're not an assistant or anything, but do you think you could go to the storage closet and get another one? Yeah, on it. Taking so long, I thought you might need a hand. I've got it covered. Tommy's told me all about you. The girl next door. Weird, he's never mentioned you. That's because you two aren't friends anymore. Tommy was sad for months when he first came to Texas, but pretty soon he was playing football, going to parties, dating me. He had a life in Texas, a good one. Always wanted Tika to be happy. See, that's the thing. Tommy is happy with me.
I'm fine, guys. Really? I just forgot to eat breakfast this morning. Seriously, you should lie down. I'm supposed to be on set. I don't think you're going anywhere today, sister. Stop telling me what to do. You have no idea what I've been going through. But I do. It started a few years ago. This little voice in my head said that I wasn't enough. It said I needed to be prettier, so I changed the way I looked. Then the voice said that I needed to be thinner, so I stopped eating. <laughs> People around me didn't even notice. I constantly compared myself to them. I mean, I tried every new fad, every new diet. It went on and on, and suddenly, I realized I had a problem. But you know what? That little voice is a liar. Because Quinn, you are absolutely beautiful the way you are. This isn't the prequel. Your life doesn't start when you're 20 pounds lighter. And going to a support group has really helped me to realize that. I would love for you to come with me sometime. Like that too. Come in. It's a mess. I can't believe the stars went online for another 700 years. In light years, that is only a blink of an eye. Our minds are melded, always. This moment of happiness, I need to remember it forever. Goodbye, Skerritt. Asya, my two hearts are already in pain. I don't have a heart, and yet... Cut! That was great! That's a wrap, everybody! Great shoot! <laughs> Hey. It's cool seeing your words come to life, huh? Yeah, we definitely got some good stuff. All right, so I was wondering, does Carlos, I mean, no, no, scare it. He gets sick from the food on his planet. So that's why Asia has to go and save him. We already filmed that. I knew that, duh. It's fine, you didn't have time to read the script. <laughs> Hey, y'all. I just wanted to thank everyone for graciously accepting me here and out of way. It's been a wonderful spring break. Even though Tommy's made so many friends back in Texas, y'all are his day one originals. Anybody else find it kind of weird that she calls him Tommy? I just can't wait for Tommy to come back to his real home soon. Chris, you should go after her. I had no idea you were going through that. You could have told me. We all have our inner demons. Thank you for being such an amazing friend to Quinn. And an even better girlfriend. So, I hate so's. <laughs> There's something I've been wanting to tell you, and I keep waiting for the right moment, so here it goes. I, um, I got off the wait list for the art college that I wanted to go to. Really? Oh my god, I'm so happy for you! The thing is, it's in Florence, Italy, and it starts in June. You? As in two months? Yeah. I'm sorry I bailed. I know how important it is to you. Yeah, you seemed really upset in there. About TK? No, it's not about TK. It's Sadie. She's rubbing it in my face. I don't know if it was TK or not, but you haven't been here with me this entire year. 
I don't know what to say. I mean, I'm trying my best. You can't just say that you're gonna be somewhere. You actually have to show up. I showed up today. And you left. Wes. I'm sorry, Ryan, but this is over. next time on Chicken Girls. On this team, you're gonna mind your own business. You can't just keep avoiding me. It's too hard to be around you right now. Everyone in on one, two, 